Hey guys, it's Cannibal, and we just came back from Colorado. <laughs> this is the back. Colorado Comic Con. Okay, and there's my cat. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Let's try that again. Hey guys, it's Cannibal, and we just got back from Colorado Springs Comic Con, yay! So uh, this year it was at the Broadway, Broadmoor World Arena in Colorado Springs. It's a great venue right across from the Hampton Inn. We could just walk straight there, and yeah, you could see the line from our hotel room. <laughs> Anyways, it was so exciting. There were great cosplayers, panels, guests. I met Joey Fatone, Fatoni from <laughs> NSYNC. I spent all night watching NSYNC music videos. He doesn't have the spiked hair anymore, of course. He's from Impractical Jokers too. You can see this line in between us right here. This is a, a COVID barrier. He's like, just lean up against it. It's really dumb, but just lean up against it. And I couldn't stop thinking maybe the barrier has COVID now, but we're all vaccinated, so it's okay. Yeah, and I got to meet Lucy Pohl from Overwatch. She's Mercy from Overwatch, and if you know me, I have 2,000 hours on Overwatch. Here, I'll show you. This is my husband's computer. Sorry. Um, I uninstalled Overwatch because I got mad at the game, so here is my career profile. I guess all competitive seasons? Oh, wait, all modes. You want to go to all modes? 2,068 hours, so almost 2,000 exact, or over 2,000 exactly, 2,057 hours in competitive alone. Started in gold, ended up in gold. So yeah, when I would do workshops and classes in Kansas City, in Texas, in California, I would come home and I would play Overwatch, a lot of Overwatch, and Lucy is one of my role models. I mean, I listen to her voice all the time <laughs> and the cosplayers too were so amazing we were in line waiting to take a photo with her so i talked to her about a lot of things she's really nice actually we got a photo together too man it was awesome so we took a, a picture together ah so cute um she is beautiful and very talented and i remember asking her um about the union like sag aftra and i told her i'm non-union and I mean, I may be union in the future. I've been in two union projects, but she's like, oh, that's fine. I mean, I wasn't in SAG-AFTRA to begin with anyway. I started out non-union too. And I'm like, oh, well, that makes me feel way more reassured. <laughs> I did the Heroes Never Die t-shirt for this picture. <laughs> Doesn't she look like Mercy? It's so cute. So that was really, really, oh no, did I bend it? That's what the sleeve is for, is in case I bend it. Yeah. <laughs> also, thanks, Paul. Paul put these pictures in sleeves for me so I wouldn't ruin the pictures. <laughs> Lucy also signed this Mercy picture. Yay. If you have the, the skin, this skin is the first skin I bought on Overwatch. And then I bought the Lucio emote. My number one main, you rock. And for Catabell, someone called the Wambulance. I asked her if she would do that line with me. And this is what we recorded. Hey everybody, it's Lucy Pohl, the voice of Mercy on Overwatch, hanging out with my number one thing, Catabell in Colorado Springs. And this is a very, very important message to everybody. Someone called the Wambulance. Wah, wah, wah. Oh my gosh, I am swooning. I am swooning. Like, not in a crush way, but in a, like, oh my gosh, this is real way. Because I've spent a lot of time playing her character, and here she is in real life. And I'm a voice actress, too, so I'm, like, aspiring. She's my role model here. And I'm talking to her, and she said my name, and she's like... Oh, Catabelle, this is, you play a lot of Mercy, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> it was just really, I was really excited, um, if you can tell. So first I explained to her, like me and my my husband was like, we met on Overwatch, and she's like, oh, how? So I kind of explained a mini story. Uh, Kevin and I met on Overwatch. He was Winston, and I was Mercy, but I asked him to play Reinhardt on Oasis and be reasonable, and, if he, and he said... <laughs> uh, 
if I had a dime for every time a woman said to be reasonable, then I would be really rich. But it's okay because I play poker. <laughs> yeah, I know it kind of sounds conceited, but whatever. Uh, he added me after that. <laughs> I guess the rest is history. I was in Kansas City, he was in Chicago. So it was a really sweet story, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, that was my time at Colorado Springs Comic Con. Next week I'm gonna be at Nondesucon and I'm going to interview one of my friends and voice actors, Danny Chambers. She's really talented too, so I can't wait for that. So until next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye. <laughs>